what's up everybody AJ here and in this video we're going to be talking about Graham the TV show this is going to be my review of the show I know it's kind of late right now we're in season 2 um, the next episode is the last episode of this season I didn't even know that until I watched this episode but let me tell you how I got into watching this show I used to watch a show called Angel and the show ended up getting cancelled that used to be my favorite show and then about a year or so ago I was reading online that two of the creators or writers, whatever, they were going to make this new show called Grimm. So I ended up checking it out and I like it. It reminds me sort of Angel because, you know, he could change his face and stuff like that. Um, so basically, let's go ahead and get into this episode. The episode starts off with Nick and Juliet in the car and she's apologizing to him because, you know, she forgot about him or whatever. And, you know, he's basically saying there's no need to apologize. They end up kissing and stuff. And I'm glad to see that she's getting her memory back. And they're getting back together. Um, because at first I didn't know, you know, what was going to go on with that. If she was ever going to get her memory back or what was going to happen. And, like I said, it's good to see that she's getting it back. Now, the base of this episode, there's a guy. His face blows up like a blowfish or something with spikes on it. And he spits green stuff into people's face. Now, when he does that, they go into this death-like death state and then eventually come back and Nick is trying to figure out you know what's going on with them but every time they go to the morgue to look at the bodies or whatever they're gold because like I said they're zombies or whatever and then later on in the episode we have Juliet she goes to Monroe and she wants to know what Nick wanted to show her the night that she blacked out so he's kind of hesitant to do it so anyways he goes to the spy shop with Rosalie and Bud and they end up showing her you know what they look like and at first she was kind of shocked by it but she came back in and you know she took it pretty well and I'm glad that now she knows Hank knows and you know it's like a team it reminds like I don't want to compare the show to Angel but that's what it reminds me of because you know they had Angel and then the other people with him so I think it's good that they know now because they need to help him out and we have Adeline and she you know she's still trying to sell her baby or whatever her unborn baby because it has royal blood. The chief doesn't know, his brother doesn't know, and she's trying to get rid of the baby. Now the two witches, well the gypsy and the hexen beast, they're trying to, you know, they're, it seems like they're gonna get into some big thing about who's getting the baby or whatever. And now they wanna start auctioning off the baby, and the chief, find, I mean, yeah, the chief ends up finding out because his guy that with the royal family calls him and lets him know, but he still doesn't know that it's you know that it could be his baby or his brother's baby <laughs> excuse me um, I'm getting really into this story I pay more attention to the actual overall story than compared to the story within the story so so far this episode was really good and then you know at the end of the episode Nick he ends up going to dinner with Juliet again and you know it looks like things are going to get get good again so you know the story within the story the thing with the guy that's been turning people into zombies. He's just going around basically in the episode recruiting more zombies. And at the end of the episode, they have him, and he has like a, I would say like a trailer or something with all kinds of uh, people that he's recruited into a zombie thing. And then at the end of the episode, uh, the captain's brother comes down to Portland and the captain doesn't know, so he, he calls him and he says, hey, you know, we should meet up. And he tells him that he's in Portland. And the captain, he seems kind of worried and stuff because, you know, his brother's there. So they show his brother in Portland. This is the very, you know, very couple, last couple of minutes of the episode. His brother's there and his brother has some kind of connection, I guess, with the, the, the zombie guy. And the zombie guy comes in there and it just says to be continued. So I'm looking forward to the next episode. It's going to be the season finale. Make sure you check out my videos um, that I'll have coming out soon. I'll do more reviews the episode of season three. Make sure to subscribe until.